The last couple of days here in Wales and the UK have been dominated by child abuse accusations levelled at children's homes in the northeast of Wales. These accusations were looked at by an inquiry called the Waterhouse Inquiry that reported in the early 2000s and made significant recommendations to ministers. Some of those recommendations have been acted on, but many people feel that there was certain areas of the inquiry that didn't come into the public domain. Today in First Minister's Questions, I highlighted the joint approach Approach that was required to resolve these concerns from the UK government and the Welsh government. And I believe to date the First Minister and the UK government and the Prime Minister David Cameron have acted with the best interest of everyone at heart. I also challenged the First Minister on when the Children's Commissioner for Wales first raised his observations with him, because it's important to understand the role of the Children's Commissioner in, in investigating these abuse allegations. He is, meeting the, he is meeting the Children's Commissioner this afternoon and I look forward to hearing what statement he will bring forward so that we can know that the Children's Commissioner and his staff are working with all parties to resolve these issues. And finally, I challenge the First Minister on the recommendations of the Waterhouse Review and its report and making sure that those recommendations had been acted on. One of the areas I do have grave concern is around advocacy because there are examples where recommendations on advocacy in particular were not acted Acted on, and I do hope that the First Minister will engage with all parties to make sure that the services are provided so that when victims do come forward, their concerns are taken seriously, are investigated, and if action needs to be taken, that action is taken.